So today we're going to be adding mixed numbers with regrouping. So our first example, we'll take the mixed number 1 and 3 fifths, and then we're going to add 6 and 4 fifths. And step number 1 is adding the fractions. So 3 fifths plus 4 fifths is 7 fifths. The second step, we add the whole numbers. 1 plus 6 is 7. Now, 7 fifths is an improper fraction. That's a fraction that's more than 1. So we're going to take that improper fraction and we're going to change it into a mixed number. So we'll take 7, divide by 5, and that's 1. Subtract the 5, we get 2 left over. The 2 that's left over is 2 fifths because that's what we're working with is fifths. So it's 1 and 2 fifths. That 7 fifths becomes 1 and 2 fifths. Well, we've actually taken that and we changed it into a mixed number. And then we're not going to even use that 7 fifths anymore because we've changed it now to 1 and 2 fifths. We're going to take that 1 and 2 fifths and add it to the whole number 7 in our answer. And that's the way that you regroup it as a mixed number. You regrouped it by making, giving that 7 fifths a whole number and a fraction. So 2 fifths plus nothing is 2 fifths. 7 plus the 1 is 8. 8 and 2 fifths. So we've regrouped that mixed number. So our next example is 5 and 11 thirteenths plus 7 and 9 thirteenths. So we're going to start the same way that we did. We're going to add up the fractions first. 11 thirteenths plus 9 thirteenths is 20 thirteenths. And then adding up the whole numbers, 5 plus 7 is 12. Now we're going to take that 20 thirteenths. That 20 thirteenths is an improper fraction or a fraction that's bigger than 1. We're going to regroup it into a mixed number, into a whole number and a fraction. And we do that by dividing 13 into 20. When we divide 13 into 20, we're going to get 1. 1 times 13 is 13. Subtract. Now we have 7 left over. The 7 we have left over is 7 thirteenths. So we were working with 20 thirteenths. We made it into 1 with 7 thirteenths left over. And that is the same. The 1 and 7 thirteenths is the same as the 20 thirteenths. Move it over. We get rid of that 20 thirteenths. We don't need it anymore because we changed it. We regrouped it. 7 thirteenths plus nothing is 7 thirteenths. And then the 12 plus 1 is 13. That's the way that you regroup the improper fraction. The last example we're going to do today is 3 and 5 sevenths. And we're going to add to that 6 and 4 sevenths. Step 1, as always, add the fractions. 5, five sevenths plus 4 sevenths is 9 sevenths. Add the whole numbers. 3 plus 6 is 9. Take that improper fraction, 9 sevenths. We need to divide it. That's how we regroup. We make whole numbers and fractions so that we can add them to the right side. We do that little division problem, and we end up with 1, and then 2 left over. That 2 is sevenths, because we started with 9 sevenths. So that 1 is really 7 sevenths, and then the 2 sevenths is left over. We're going to get rid of that 9 sevenths, bring it back over, and add it. We're going to add the 1 to the whole number side and leave the 2 sevenths on the fraction side. So we end up with 2 sevenths, and 9 plus 1 is 10, 10 and 2 sevenths.